Good morning, Krusty Crew. So today we are doing the window tint on the Corolla, like I promised last video. So, yeah, basically it's just installing window tint. There's not a lot to it. I don't really know how to install it, but that's what I'm figuring out right now. Um, so I'm gonna start off by doing side windows before I do the rear window. We will not be doing the windshield because it's kind of a legal problem there. And this car after all is my daily, so I wanna keep it as legal-ish as I can. Here are the tint rolls. I got a little knife there, some soapy water. I also have a heat gun in this bag as well, because I'm gonna need to use it, most likely, considering that this glass here is this little thing called curved. So, yeah. Hopefully I can get it done tonight. I don't know if I can or not, but we'll see. Maybe, maybe not. If we don't, it's really not a big deal. Now, we start installing. Here's kind of the uh, comparison-ish. There's 50 and there's none. Can't really see it very well actually because the, this garage light, I can only do so much. Okay guys, it's a different day. The windows, four of them, are tinted. The rear window is not tinted, however, because the film I was using was pretty decent for the smaller windows, but for the large window, the adhesive didn't work correctly. It didn't stick properly. So I did everything right, but at least I think I did everything right. I don't know, the, the adhesive, because I felt the back of it and it just wasn't sticky at all, so yeah, and I ordered more tint film, but it hasn't showed up yet, which is quite unfortunate. But anyway, it's raining outside, but I'm gonna see if I can just run out there quickly and just show you guys what's up. Right, back window not tinted. These windows are tinted, and I've relocated the front plate. All right, cool, let's go back to the garage. Okay, right, I just wanna have a quick chat um, because some of you guys may have noticed that videos recently are just not exactly kind of the same energy as what they used to be anyway. There's definitely a lot of lack in detail. It's kind of just like, here's before. Oh, we're cutting straight to after and there's no real footage uh, of the process of getting uh, to the after. There's no during part. And I think a lot of that is just because I start working on something, I put the camera down, and I just keep going. I just hustle it out. Is hustle the right word? I don't know, I'll use it. You know, then we get to the after, and you know, I mean like that's great for saving time and stuff, but it's definitely not great in terms of content. And I think that's also reflecting on view counts. Uh, in fact, my, the last like four videos I posted, it's like the lowest views I've ever gotten. Uh, on single videos, so overall the channel is doing all right, but just based on the the analytics of individual videos I've posted within the last like couple months, uh, views have been down, uh, and I think that is partly because of the kind of energy that I'm putting into these videos, because 
what ends up happening is I record a before and then oh suddenly here's the after and there's no detail and I think you know you guys want to see the detail of what's going on and I'm not providing that the actual quality of the content is going down so I'm gonna try something new here and I hope that this changes for the better so that's why I'm trying it uh, pretty much from now on whenever I'm actually working on the car doing anything with the car the camera is gonna be on it's always gonna be on and I hope that that is just gonna flip me back into oh you know this is what I want to do I want to make videos about my cars and about me working on my cars and stuff because I feel like right now I'm just not in that mindset I'm just kind of in the hustle hustle on the grind don't worry about the content it'll work out and that's it's not working out so anyway I hope you enjoyed this video it's honestly I feel like this video is less about the Corolla and more about how my content's being a bit whack at the moment but you know what it's changing plus we're gonna I'm gonna make videos about the Subaru again don't worry eventually um, I don't really know what to do with this car though but I'll find something something will get done with this car um, but anyway that's gonna be it for this video hopefully you enjoyed if you did go ahead leave a like comment below and subscribe to the channel if you knew until next time goodbye